Welcome to Daily Action Picks. I'm Mike Calabrese, and here is my top player prop for Friday of the NCAA tournament. The Texas Longhorns are traveling to Milwaukee to take on the surging Virginia Tech Hokies fresh off of their ACC tournament championship. But in this one, I actually like the point guard from UT. Marcus Carr, over 11 and a half points, piqued my interest because he's averaged 10 shots across his last 11 games. And really, when you dig even deeper into it, it comes down to his foul shooting. In the last two months, he's had six games in which he's taken eight or more foul shots, but he's also had seven games where he's taken zero. So it really comes down to the game plan here. Will Texas allow him to create his own shot? According to shotquality.com, Carr is in the 92nd percentile in terms of frequency of creating his own shot. So he's not going to be relying on his teammates for cuts to the basket, pick and roll situations. He's an instant offensive man himself. And now, luckily, it's going to be a tight one here because UT is a short favorite, minus one against the Hokies. It may go off as a pick'em, and the chances for foul shots at the end are pretty high. Marcus Carr, a 78% foul shooter, someone who's high usage, going to have the ball in his hands. I like that to potentially push us over this number of 11 and a half. And finally, this is a big stage for Marcus Carr. This kid scored nearly 20 points per game last year for Minnesota. It's one of the reasons he was one of the most highly sought-after players in the transfer portal. And we saw flashes of it at times this year, but I think the NCAA tournament gives him an opportunity for a new stage, a new moment. I think he's going to seize it here with all the usage and the minutes. He plays 31 minutes per game, but that's been closer to 35 in Big 12 play down the stretch. So he's going to be on the floor. He's going to have the ball in his hands, and I think he's going to give us every chance to go over this 11 and a half number. It's one of the reasons why it's juiced negatively to minus 125. I don't mind laying the juice here. I'm going to go ahead with Carr over 11 and a half points.